Hey everyone, what's up? This is Jen, and in today's video, I wanted to show you how I make my mug mock-ups for my Etsy store. Since in the last two videos, I showed you how I designed it and published it into my Etsy store. So, let's get started. Alright, so I use Photoshop for this. I do a couple things, because some of the images I have uh, need to be resized. So first, I'm going to show you how I make it, and then how I resize it, okay? So, open Photoshop. Here's a little slow, so bear with me for a second. All right, once it is open, press the open button right here. Go to wherever you have saved your mock-ups. Mine is in my drive. Let's open a couple. So I'm also going to show you two ways to save it. All right, so let's open a couple. Let's open two and three. Open. All right, so now that these are open, your images are open, go to File, Place Embedded, go to where your saved image is, mine's in Downloads, click on the image, push Placed, or Place, Resize, fit your mug Make it a little bigger center it the best you can and then click once sometimes twice and you have just made your mock-up image now we're going to save it this is the first way to save it. Go to File, Save As, because we want to save a copy. We don't want to save over the image. We want to save a copy of the image. So, Save As. Click that. Name your image. You want the file type to be a JPEG file. And I'm going to save it in my downloads. And then you press save. And then OK. And you have just saved a copy of your image mockup. All right, so X out of that and push no because you don't want to save over your image. So push no. We already saved a copy, so we don't need to save that original image all right so now let me show you one more time go to file go to embed place embedded i'm sorry pick your image place resize your image Center it. Okay. Just a little bit more. All right. Yeah. Center it. Now click. Click again. And this is the second way to save your image. Hold down Control and Shift and then push S on your keyboard. And that is the save as, saving a copy. Not saving over, but saving a copy of your mock-up image. So I'll do that one more time. Hold down Control and Shift and then push S on your keyboard. And then name your image If 
file type you want is a JPEG. Click on that. I am going to save it into my downloads. Push save. Push OK. Come up here, X and No. Now that you've done that, you X out of here. So, when you download an image, or not download, upload an image into your Etsy store, it has to be 2,000 pixels. So we're going to resize these images to make them 2,000 pixels. So, I do that in paint.net. And then I go to File, and I go to Open, and I choose my mock-up image, which is in my downloads. Let's go find one. Okay, right here. And push Open, and then you go to your Images, or Image up here, click Resize. Alright, so the width, just put 2,000, because really that's all you need to do. And then push OK. And this one, you can save over. So click your file, and click Save. Push OK, and then exit out. And you resized it. Okay, the next one. Do it again. File. Open. Click on your image and open. Then open image. Resize. Your width. Put 2,000 and click OK. And now, if you want to save this image in the second way, press Control S. And that will save your image over, like over your image. Okay, press OK. And then X out. Alright, now let's go to your Etsy shop, in my case, mine, and open your browser. Go to your Etsy shop. Click on your mug that you're making the mock-ups for. Click Edit. And then click Add Photo. Downloads. And then choose your mockup photos. And open. Right, position them, click and drag them to the first two, and then adjust your thumbnail if needed, make it closer so people can see it, farther, you want it as close as possible, and then you press save. After you adjust your thumbnail, press Publish, and you have put your mock-ups into your store. I hope this video helps. If it helps, put a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel to stay up to date on all my videos, because not only do I show you how to do like designs and stuff like that, but I show you how to make a passive income from your home. So, subscribe.
thumbs up and stay up to date on all my videos. I will see you in the next video. I hope you all have a wonderful day and peace out.